Hello everybody, I'm games 522 and welcome back to more Mega Man 2. In the last episode, we managed to beat Quick Man. And so, now we're going to fight Metal Man. Most people usually go after Metal Man first, but when I played this game for the first time, I didn't really understand how strong Metal Blade, his weapon, really is. And just to tell you, I was... I, it wasn't until I was 14 until I first played this game. Alright. So make sure you try to avoid the uh, spike traps here. They can't be damaged in any way. And since there's so many of them on screen, you may notice that like you probably can't see me. Ow. That's probably because, like, there's so many sprites on screen that I can't render them. So, yeah. If you guys couldn't see me, I apologize. It's the game, it wasn't me. And these guys are moles. You want to watch out for them, because they do, they do quite a bit of damage. I'm trying to destroy these guys to get through, and hopefully they drop life from me. A little bit of an untold story, I don't know if I've never really told this to anybody, but when I was playing Little Big Planet 1, I actually tried recreating this entire stage on Little Big Planet. And let's just say it was far from perfect because the only way I knew how to get conveyor belts to work, it wasn't easy. I got it to work though, but it was just sloppy and you died pretty much all the time. And we got these gear guys. Oh wow, would you look at that? Right when I friggin' needed it. Ah, oh, he's back again. If you manage to destroy him, it slows the gear down. I didn't know that. The more you know. I just totally just put that in one. Ow. Oh yay, more life. Take that out! I didn't mean to jump that high. Okay, there we go. As much as I'd want to go for that 8 tank, since I have 3 and you can only carry 4, it's not really worth losing the life for it. I hate these things. They go really fast when you're on their level. Since we're at the boss, so I'm going to quit quick boomerang. As you can see, this is how it works. It fires fast and it has lots of ammo. And you don't, and uh, no, you don't get the ammo back once it comes back to you. Alright, so here we go. The, what's funny about Metal Man, I don't know if you guys know this, but whenever, me whenever you press A, it makes Metal Man jump or throw a gear at you. Try to play it safe. Okay, I got him. That's it for Quick Man. But yeah, as I was saying, if you press the fire button, it makes him jump and throw gears at you. So technically, you kind of are in control of Metal Man, which is a really nice. It's a really nice thing that's just there. But yeah, we beat Metal Man, so he got his weapon, Metal Blade. If you don't know what Metal Blade is, it's basically you throw a circular saw blade and you can throw it in eight directions, and it has a lot of ammunition. And practically almost everything in this game is weak to it, so, yeah. Well, that's it for Metal Man. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next stage. Till then, see you then.